Hi everybody, it's Boaz Feiler. I'm here with the Daily Astrology Forecast for May 1st, 2016. Happy Labor Day and uh, workers of the world unite. Okay, let's concentrate on astrology. So, we have the moon in Aquarius today and it's squaring Mercury that is in retro. It's not a great time to make decisions. It's not a great time for navigation through our lives. We could be a little edgy today and we have to take this day easy. Really take it easy today. You know, we are in a few days that the sun is sextiling Neptune and trining Jupiter. It's a fun few days. It's a day, it, these are days that we could recharge our batteries. We feel more artistic. We feel more benevolent. We feel more um, spiritual and we can really reconnect to life at the most basic, but basic maybe isn't the right word, you know. It's the simplest of levels, you know. It's the, the natural level. And this is even strengthened by the passing of Venus back into her house, into Taurus, or forward into her house, the house of Taurus, really allowing us at these times, at these days, to recharge our batteries from whatever is natural, you know, from the aesthetics of nature, from sensory pleasures, like eating, drinking, and loving, and touching, and, and seeing, and hearing, and all the things that we were giving when we entered into this body. So this is a good source of energy and replenishing whatever was lost during the crazy dance of the mutable signs in the sky. But as I said, uh, there's a square today to Mercury in retro and then the moon turns void of course until 1630 Central European time, that's around 9.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Then it moves to Pisces and it enters Pisces sextiling Venus, that's around uh, 1400 hours Eastern Standard Time, around 2000 hours Central European Time and that's a very positive aspect. It's an aspect that allows us to reconnect to people in our life, to draw in money, to enjoy ourselves better. But there's also a square to Mars at the same time, making us more edgy and intolerant. So we have to watch that and not get into conflicts or fights. Mercury is still in, rep in retrograde until the 22nd. It's conjunct Vesta talks a lot about our dedication and things that are important to us in our lives. And sextal Chiron, so there's some healing going on. Thank you for listening. And I'll see you all tomorrow. This is Boaz Fowler. Goodbye.